hope you had fun with your house and your, who you all have in your house living with you. I do hope you had fun and that you had fun painting your pets. And did you ask mommy to send your pets for us? Hey, did you ask mommy? Good. There we go. Okay. Today, we are going to end off our five days today with our last day that we say that we are special, we are unique, and there's only one of us. Can you show me one? One. So there's only one of us. And there's a nice song that we can sing today, and it says, I am special. You ready? Good. I am special, I am special, you can see, you can see, someone very special, someone very special, yes, it's me, yes, it's me, yes, you are so special, hey, and remember, we are special from our head to our tippy toes, yes, you remembered, from our head to our tippy toes. Well done. Okay, so our art activity for today is again going to be a hand tracing activity, but we're going to make a little book. Okay, so your hand looks like this when you've done when you're done tracing it. Okay, but you must ask mommy to fold the paper and you trace your hand on the fold, and then when you cut it out, you don't cut. On the folded side so that you can open it for a booklet like that okay now these are my hands so they are quite big all right so when you're done tracing your hand and cutting that out with or without mommy's help then you can use lots of different decorations and you can decorate the front of your hand can you see so again, I made my name. Remember, on the first day, we did our names. Hey? And our starting sound. So you're going to write your name on there. And then you can decorate it as you want. With paint and stickers and drawing little hearts and flowers on there if you want. Okay? So then, when this is done, you are going to ask mommy to weigh you and measure you. All right, so if you weigh, you will stand on a scale and then mommy is going to write on the inside of your hand. She's going to write what you weigh and how tall you are. Okay, so it's what you weigh and how tall you are. And on the other side, mommy can write your birthday. Okay, so you're going to write your birthday on the one side. And on the other side, after mommy's weighed you, she's going to write your weight in here. And after mommy's measured you, she's going to write your length in here. Okay. And then you ask mommy, okay, mommy, I want to lie down on the floor. So then you lie down on the floor and mommy is going to take a piece of string or a ribbon or chalk, depending what type of floor you have. And mommy's going to measure you from the top of your head to your heels as you're lying on the floor. And then you are going to take some toys and you are going to measure. So you're going to use cars and you're going to measure yourself on the string or in between the chalk marks. And you're going to say, okay, I am 15 cars long. Or you can walk on that line and you can say, okay, I am 10 feet long. Or if you want to measure with your hands, you measure side by side. So you measure one, two, three, four. And you can say, I'm 20 hands long. So you guys must do this measuring activity today. Okay? So remember, first let mommy weigh you on the scale. Stand still, don't move around. So let mommy measure you on the scale. And then let mommy measure your length. And then mommy will write it in your hand. And then you ask mommy, mommy, I want to lie down because I want to measure myself. Okay, and then you use your toys or your feet or your hands to measure yourself. Okay, well done. The last, second last thing we're going to do is you are going to print your hand in paint on a paper. Like this. Okay. 
while this handprint is drying, you, mommy, you must give your little one red paper and then they are going to cut out a heart. So fold the paper in half and draw with a thick black cokey this curve for them so that when they open it, it is a heart. And then what we're doing today is we're going to draw ourselves in our heart. So we're going to draw, I have a head, I have a body, I have legs and arms. I've got five fingers on every hand. I've got a feet. Okay, I've got eyes and a nose and a mouth and I have hair. What did I miss? Oh, my ears. Okay, so there we go. And this heart says, I love my stuff. All right, so this is Simone and she's in the heart and Simone loves her stuff. Okay, so remember when you draw yourself, you have a head and a body and legs and arms and feet and hands and eyes and a nose and a mouth and ears. Okay, remember that. Righty. So when, now when your other hand is dry like that, then you're going to use two different colors of paper. So you, on my page, I have red and yellow. But you can use any two different colors you want. And then you are going to tear it and paste a border like this. And we are going to paste one color, then another color. So if you are using red and yellow, you will start with yellow, then red, then yellow, then red, then yellow, then red. So you are going to pack a pattern around your handprint as a border. Okay. So we're packing a pattern around our handprint as a border okay and that's it for this week boys and girls let's sing that song again that i am special song i want you to remember that you are special i am special i am special you can see you can see someone very special someone very special yes it's me yes it's me well done, boys and girls. Teacher will see you for the next week. All right. Have a good time. Enjoy. And I'll see you. And stay safe. And remember to wash your hands and keep your masks on. Okay. Bye-bye.